I feel like everyone has come across a Karen at one point in their life. It could have been at the shops, at school, at a cinema. Nearly everyone has probably passed a Karen. But if you haven't, then you're a very lucky person. In today's video, we're gonna be having a look at some of the Karens of TikTok. If you don't know what a Karen is, it's basically a middle-aged white woman who seems to shout at everyone. And they usually irritate you. On my main channel, I have a character called Karen and I go on to Omegle and fight people. But in today's video, we're gonna look at some crazy Karens in TikTok. Before the video starts, leave like, and subscribe and let's have a look at some crazy Karens. I'm putting you on citizen's arrest right now. Are you right serious now. for what? Because look how close you parked. Okay, I'll move my car. No, no, you're not moving your car. We're staying right here till the cops come. Okay, what is going on? This is the first TikTok and we're only halfway through it. Why is this lady so mad? No, I I'm gonna move my car oh, no, right no. now. You're staying right here. Stop filming me. I've got absolutely no idea why she's mad. Like the car doesn't even look that close. I'm kind of looking at this one and thinking it might be a tiny bit fishy. Like I feel like this one might be fake. See, whenever I watch these Karens, videos you can tell which ones are real and which ones aren't and i've got a feeling this might be a fake one hey internet this man and his doberman just attacked me and my chihuahua wait so you're telling me that that dog and that man attacked her chihuahua i'm pretty sure if a dog that size attacked her chihuahua the dog would be dead Ow! what are you doing no he didn't what is wrong with these people? Like, I swear only Americans are like this. I've never, ever, ever seen somebody like this in Northern Ireland or the UK or Europe or anywhere else in the world except for America. Like, why are these crazy ladies always coming from America? This is what really scares me about America is that the people are crackers. Like, they're crazy. A lot of them are weird. It really scares me knowing that I could literally walk out of a shop and a Karen like that could punch me. Hey, yes. hey, okay, what? I'll call you back. Hey, I have seen you around this neighborhood too many times. This is ridiculous. Your, your car Why is she so mad? Loud. No, 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 no. There are children that live in this neighborhood. You need to drive somewhere. You know what? I'm calling the police. This is insane. Don't you even think about going anywhere. I'm calling right now. This is insane. You cannot just be driving this loud car in this neighborhood at all hours. I'm calling right now. Don't you even think about going anywhere. This, this, no, no. This is ridiculous. Hey, I Okay, so Karen seems to be in a bad mood today. I can understand if he's making a lot of noise and if he's purposely making noise. But like, he was literally just driving past. Like, it's a neighborhood. You're allowed to drive for a neighborhood. I'm pretty sure there isn't a law where you can't drive into a neighborhood you don't live in. Like, imagine he was dropping somebody off or giving somebody a lift. These ladies have way too much time in their hands. Like, literally, what do they do? I'm pretty sure all they do in their day is just sit back, eat food, and complain. I always wonder what happens to them and what results in them becoming like that. Like, what happened in her life? Who broke her? Somebody obviously broke her heart. I dare you to run me over. Get off the hood of my car. No, I'm not moving. Alright, what do I do right now? You did not just honk at me! What is up with these Karens? Why is she just randomly attacking his car in the middle of a car park? There is no cars around! Say, I don't understand. It really infuriates me and I'm actually happy I don't live in America because if something like this happened to me, I probably would just turn around and punch them. And I know that sounds awful and a really bad thing to say, but I just get really, really, really irritated by people like this. Like, there genuinely is something wrong with them. Oh my gosh. Okay, this is called copyrighted music, but she literally just smashed that. Why did she do that? The caption says this. Throw back to the time a customer got mad at Bredo because they thought he was being disrespectful. If he was being disrespectful, I can understand if she's upset. But really, do you have to grab something and smash it to the ground? Like, why do they act like this? I've got no idea why they do it. There's literally no reason for them to act like that. It's so weird. The girl. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god, she's so god. mad. I didn't even Holy you know, Karen. Jesus Holy Karen. Christ. Calm down, Karen. I want, I want your money. I want, I want everything. Stop <laughs> filming me. Stop filming me. What are you going to oh, do? Yeah? What are you going to do? I'm going to film you. I'm going to film you. What are you going to do, I Karen? Know. Where do you live? Where do you live? Call your mother. Where do you live? Look it. There's a fucking scratch on my car. There. Look. Karen, say hi to the Take camera. Take a picture of this. Take a picture. Why did she look so scared? Like she was literally backing away from the girl on the bike. See, I don't understand. I feel like these Karens are just really, really, really terrified, scared women. Like I feel so bad for them, but then I also hate them. Like why is she acting like that? I can understand if the girl maybe hit her car. Yes, that gives you a reason to be angry. If I had an expensive car and I got ruined by somebody like that, I probably would punch the child. Like I would be extremely angry. But like it's the fact that she's running around like a headless chicken. Like she's hot around like a frog. I looked at the car and I didn't see any scratches whatsoever. I think we need to put all these cars onto a secret planet and never see them again. 
I, I really oh can't get gosh. out. I'm sorry, my mom's inside. I can't. I really can't. I'm sorry. Why is she knocking the window like that? Call I didn't do anything. I, I... I can't, I'm sorry. That's literally crazy psychopathic behavior. The caption says this Karen literally almost broke my window knocking on it telling me to move my car because I parked in her parking spot. But she doesn't own the CVS parking lot, threatening to call the police. For some reason, Americans seem to always argue over parking spots. Is it really worth arguing over a spot to park your car? Like, I can understand if you always go to the same place, it might be annoying. But come on, is there any reason to freak out like that? And it's the fact that she's literally banging in the window. Like, that must be terrifying. I feel so bad for that person girl. The girl's called Miriam and she looks terrified. I could not imagine a woman like that trying to break down my window like it's crazy behaviour. Honestly, I would just call the police on her and get her arrested. Calm oh down. my gosh, yes, this is a famous Karen video. Okay, I'm sorry. He it's apologized. My, it's, my, it's, it's my fault. He apologized. Yeah, I know. It's and my... you know what? It, that didn't upset me. But yeah. the bitch ass hoe sorry. that told I'm me guess. to calm down? What I'd like you to do is apologize instead of being a bitch. You're calling me sorry, but you're calling me a bitch. I'll oh, set, sorry. An, set an example. I'm sorry. My kids can't hear me calling you a bitch. Your window's open. They can't hear me because they're listening to kids bop. They can't hear me because I'm listening to kids bop. I feel so bad for her poor kids. But something about her is so scary. Like, I think it's the eyes. Halfway through the video, she literally looked like a lizard or like a snake. She was literally staring at the person like that, making direct eye contact, not blinking whatsoever, just looking deep into their soul. Like, that actually would scare you. She should definitely apply to a movie and be like a really scary, creepy character. Because that is stalker behavior. And by the looks of it, it's in the middle of a highway or like in a street. Do people really have the time and effort to argue like this? <gasps> that is terrifying. Okay, she's okay, using the audio, but he that apologized. is so scary. He apologized. Oh my gosh, look at her eyes. They have like popped out. Sorry. That told me to calm down? That's literally how the original like woman looked. Like, it's actually terrifying that she'd look like that. I don't know what is up with Americans. Like, it's always Americans. Nobody else around the world acts like this. It's only Americans. Uh, I don't think so. Okay, well, it's illegal to take pictures of people. But they <laughs> Karen walked into our TikTok. So, good to know. Do you want to delete it now, or do you want me to talk to someone about pursuing something with you? Since it's illegal what you just did. You can, you can talk to security if you want. Okay, let's go. Oh, that. I'm not following you. You can, you can tell them what I look like myself. Okay. Wait, is she okay. taking a photo of them? So I'll just get a of you. I swear that Karen literally just said that taking photos of people in public is illegal. So she's literally doing what she said is illegal. So in doing so, she is breaking the law. These Karens are dumb. Like, they don't have any brain cells. They're missing a lot of brain function. Like, I don't understand what is wrong with them. Can she not just go home and, like, pet her dog? She looks like a wealthy woman. Like, she looks like she's in a nice shop with AirPods and a nice phone. Can she not just walk home? Boom. Uh, yeah, next time, put a mask on. Fuck We're you. Whoa. <laughs> you still, you, even though you're in the drive-thru, you're still really close to me, so. I so like to... you maintain your six foot. I'm in my vehicle. Okay. Okay. Just put a mask on. Is it really that hard to wear a mask? Like, what is up with all these Karens and not wearing masks? Like, I literally see so many videos from people in America refusing to wear masks. They literally walk up to the worker and say this. I am an American. I can do whatever I want. This is a free country. I am a citizen of the United States of America. Like, it's crazy behavior. It doesn't affect your breathing at all. Like, people have done tests. They always pull out the same statement where it's like, oh, I've got a medical disorder. I can't wear a mask. It'll stop me from breathing. It doesn't stop you from breathing, sweetheart. It protects you. I feel like these people need to get coronavirus so they can be taken out. If you think you can take this property and do what you want with it, I'll take your property and do what I want with it. You won't. That's Is this a meal, Karen? Yeah. Yeah, Are the rhymes fucking with your head, charges, bro? Dude. Oh, you're fucking such a bunch of pussies. Bro, what what a generation of pussies. Why is he squaring up to kids? I'm so confused. He's like 50. Give me your skateboard. Give me your skateboard. I want to do whatever I want with it because That's... I can just do what I this want with other people's thing. property. This is not the same thing. It is the same thing. It is. This is why you're fucking the dumbest generation of fucking morons I've ever fucked skateboard. Ride your skateboard. Ooh. <laughs> oh, oh, oh! What are you gonna do, bro? What are you gonna do? What are you Did he literally just kiss him? He just kissed me, bro. What are you gonna do? <laughs> are, you, are you touching me or is Yeah. Oh, he's. Oh, he, is... <sighs> he literally kissed him. Go, go, go! What are you gonna do? You go. Go. Don't you touch me. Go. Don't you touch go me. now. No. Yes. 
Yeah, my mom's right there. Your... What was happening in that video? I think that's the first male Karen I've ever seen. What would you call a male Karen? Like, I feel like a male Karen should definitely be called Kyle. Literally, Kyle and Linda pulled up ready to fight them kids. And then he kissed him. Did you not see him kiss him halfway through? And then the guy's the audacity to turn around and say, are you touching me? I would literally call the police because that is just creepy. Like, do these people have kids? I'm concerned. Anyways, guys, that is the end of the video. We'd look at some really crazy Karens. I don't know how to feel. Like, all of these people are actually bonkers. There's definitely something wrong with them. If you'd like to see me do another Karen TikTok video, I definitely will because there's literally hundreds of Karens in TikTok. There's videos everywhere of freakouts. If you did enjoy this video, leave a like and subscribe. Go and watch all my other videos. And yes, I will see you all in my next video. If you ever see a Karen run, because honestly, they're gonna kidnap you.